I'm here with Nathan Backham uh, from Microsoft. So the car is really set up for law enforcement and for government officials are going to be out on the beat. Uh, they need to know more information than uh, maybe what's at hand. Uh, one of the big problems for law enforcement today is that it's really hard to see everything that's going on around them. Uh, now with the new types of cars, we have a lot of things that are in there that are standard, like the touch screen and the keyboard and the printers. But additionally, we now have IoT sensors on the car for maintenance, so people can tell whether the car needs to be maintenance or brought in. We also have these awesome license plate readers that can pick up about 5,000 license plates per minute, put that information up in the cloud as, long, as well with a 360 degree camera, HD cameras on the side, and being able to collect all that information up into Azure, at that point we can now take known information about bad actors or stolen vehicles and start letting the officers be aware of the environment that's going on around them. We're hoping with machine learning and AI in the future we can start pattern matching so if they're driving around their beat every week and we notice that there's a happens to be a car in the same spot every week and there's a breaking and entering always happening, maybe we can start pattern matching to be able to find out who the bad actor is. Uh, we also have drones that can follow it around and see a, bit, a bigger view of it. We've got robots that are on the sides and some on the top. Um, so it's really being able to just take all this data, putting it up in the cloud, being able to source that data with their data and start making relevant uh, information out of it. Amazing. And so when can we see, you know, expect seeing a car like this in the road? So today this is a reference architecture. It's something we're trying to show, really show the art of the possible. And then from there, uh, we've really been working with a bunch of different agencies and as they start to adopt the cloud and the, as we have more technology available to them uh, and they start feeling comfortable with it, hopefully we'll see it soon.